just give you an example of labor. A lot of the local labor input would have been outsourced outside this country. They would have been paid in US dollars. They would have remitted their money and would have traveled with their money. But the local people who have the skills and competencies, they are doing the job. They are being paid in local currency. The same thing applies to the area of the extraction of crude oil, you know, the, the EMP. If you go to EMP, all the, most of the onshore operations, most of the swamp operations that are today handled by Nigerians, most of the engineers working there are Nigerians. So there's massive saving in foreign exchange. And you see, the greatest source of foreign exchange saving is that the earnings of these companies are kept here in Nigeria because they are local companies. Just imagine that 10% of the crude oil, we do about 2 million barrels per day today. Just imagine 200,000 barrels, which is, is being produced by Nigerians, onshore swamp. Every earning in that money, the whole dollars, even though it's earned in foreign exchange, is repatriated back to Nigeria. Whereas if it was done by foreign companies, that money will take a flight almost as soon as it's earned. In fact, no portion, of, only a little portion to meet local working capital will be kept in Nigeria. So the strategy should, is to be able to empower Nigerians to take control as much as we are capable of doing using international standards. The jobs have, that we use to export, we are having them locally. It's, it's, it's something that gladdens everyone's heart. Over 20% of the crude oil produced in this country today, from statistics I saw, are produced by Nigerians. That's just the way to go. This is the only way to create jobs. Any, if, if extractive industry has to be handled by people who are capable of doing that. They started with downstream, they moved onshore, then they you know, moved to swamps. You know, the next place to go will be offshore. You know, NCDMB is targeting that by 2025 that close to 40% of the crude oil in the country will be handled by Nigerians. This is the only way until you have in-country uh, in operations by Nigerians. That's the only, you cannot have the jobs. We cannot continue to have people who are capable of doing it without empowering them. Malaysia was like us in the 70s. They had zero local content. But today, Malaysia has 100% local content. This is the way Nigeria is going. We are leaders in Africa today in local content and other countries are coming to learn from us. We just have to keep on going until we get to the destination.